Hey everybody, Sergeant Sarge reporting for duty. Um, welcome back to Let's Play Bioshock. And God, do I love technology. The first video I recorded today was way too loud. And then the next video was probably the last one you saw, if you're keeping up. Um, was, honestly, I was the entire time, I was like, crap, I gotta keep my face away. And then it was too quiet. I mean, that wasn't too quiet, but it wasn't that loud. So I'm just saying fuck it, and I'm gonna record and have fun with it. Because that's why I do this. It's just kind of to have fun. So... We just reached the smuggler's den. Oh, I'm searching that again. Ah, oh, they got some potato chips for me. Should I take... I think I'm gonna max out on my health here. Search again. All I got is the same crap. Whoa, Jesus! Like, more PTSD flashbacks. What is with his... Those flashbacks and the ghosts he keeps seeing? I'm stocking up first, though, bro. There is, like, no, I do not want the alcohol. Do not want the cigarettes. Uh, the, I thought I could search the pneumatic pod things. Oh, holy shit, Jesus! God damn, that scared the shit out of me. Ah, keep doing that! Be supposed to be. Alright, Jesus. Son of a. I hit R instinctually to switch to my weapons! <sighs> we all come down here. Figured we all be part of Ryan's great chain. Turns out Ryan's chain is made of gold, and ours are the sort with the big iron ball around your ankle. He's up in Fort Frolic banging fashion models. We're down in this dump yanking guts out of fish. Fontaine's promising something better. He's like a, one of us, you know? Like he's worked the day in his life. He says meet him at his fish packing joint at 11. I'll go, bring a couple of guys. Hey, it's not like things could get a lot worse. You'd be surprised what happens when you cross Ryan. Sounds like, like, really, at the end of the day, to me, it sounds like both people were kind of... A lot of alcohol down here. Getting drunk is a bad life choice, trust me. Um, was this the way that I shouldn't have gone? Like, is this the extra? I thought there was a thing, something over here. Oh, hey, a Vita chamber. I didn't even know. Oh, no, there wasn't. What the hell was I seeing? I thought there was like a passage out here. Just boop. Just a booping. Do. -do. Alright. So, definitely, I, I don't regret getting the stabilizer on the machine gun. It helps a lot. However, the fact that that's the very first freaking, uh. Uh. Find the submarine bay. Oopsie. You had your fun, but enough is enough. If you press that button, you'll learn what it means to truly be my enemy. <laughs> I'm gonna leave those there because they're useless to me. So Andrew Ryan has just uh, issued us a little warning. But uh, Andrew Ryan could suck my dick. What? I can't, there's a wall here? What the frick? What? What, what, what? How do I... Then what do I do? I can't get through over here. No, oh, now there's an arrow. Okay. Oh, over here. Also, you know, it, it's a game. Checking out over here for ooh, even better. Uh, 
get the lay of the land if nothing else. Nope. Whoopsie, wrong button. So that's Fontaine's voice. We have now officially heard the voice of Fontaine. Interesting. But that's about all I can do, and in order to progress, I have to open that door. So. happening. I'm trying to pick up the tanks. There we go. Hearing gun shots, but I ain't seeing gun shots. That's an insta kill. Holy crap, I was indeed not lied to. That was indeed an insta kill. Holy shit! Whoa, holy fuck. Sorry, Atlas. I tried. Get out! Get out and get to Arcadia! Jesus Christ! The Irish pork pie offered me a deal. I flip him Fontaine and I walk out of here. That simple. How do I know that fat fuck isn't Fontaine's guy? How do I know they're not all Fontaine's guy? Fontaine's got Adam, and everybody wants it. Ryan's got a whole lot of talk in a nice suit. 
Even down here, any idiot can see which way the wind is blowing. <sighs> That's unfortunate. Sorry, I don't have too much good commentary. That's, that's pretty sad. I feel bad for him. I, yeah, I can't even say I guess you don't screw with Fontaine because or uh, Ryan because I'm screwing with Ryan. Difference is I don't got anything to lose. Uh, this is a nice, cool new place. I forgot about this, the whole, like, you know, grassy area. You got cemeteries here and dirt and all that. I got a few more minutes before I gotta get going up for this episode, so. Ooh, it's creepy as balls, though. Alcohol. Ooh, wait, there's a corpse? What? Oh, there's a corpse. Empty hypo. It's a bunch of like scrap stuff. Uh, do you? One of my friends was like, "Yeah, don't you remember you craft things?" And I was like, "I do not remember that in the slightest." Seems like some lighters have started seeing ghosts. Yeah, ghosts. ghosts. Ryan tells me it's a side effect of this plasmid business. Is it? One poor soul's memory is getting passed on to another through genetic sampling. Leaks. Lunatics. Oh. Rebellion. Hmm. Interesting. Do do. Rice, is somebody there? Um. I am going to stop the episode here. Um, so things are getting interesting. I feel pretty bad. Ooh, there's two little sisters. Uh, so one of them, the next one, though, will give me uh, a buttload of Adam, which is good. Um, I hope you're enjoying it, because as always, I am very much. Remember to comment on the video, like the video, and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And as always, Sergeant Sarge, being relieved of duty, have a good one, guys.